Hey, it's Corey here, Canadian RC guy. Well, we're back working on the track out back. We got all the stuff to kill the grass. We bought ourselves a new sprayer. We cut everything down. We're gonna give it a quick rake. Then it's time to kill all the grass. So here we go. We went and got ourselves a new sprayer. And all it takes is vinegar, dish soap, and some salt. And we're gonna walk along and just do paths back and forth across through here. And it is gonna kill all that grass for us. It's just gonna take a few hours in all this beautiful, beautiful sun. Then we're gonna go along with our uh, uh, rototiller. We're gonna do some digging up and we're gonna build ourselves a track. We were gonna turn this into the oval track, but as we were cutting grass, we've got some really good jumps already built in. Hopefully you can see the, see the transition. Um, so I think what we're gonna end up doing is turning this into our, our rally track, that kind of thing first. Um, we got some more great bumps over here. We're gonna probably cut a little bit more into this because um, we've got another great set, uh, different layer section here. And we'll just go over to here and then it'll be kind of cut a little bit more into here. Got a little bit of old wood and an old tree to pick up, but we'll do a little bit more of a section here. And this all in here will be our nice little rally track. That should give us room to play with. So we're going to get a little bit of raking done here. Maybe we'll bring out the car for a minute, do a little bit of rip on the grass, and then it's time to start spraying. Man, these bugs are killing me out here. Springtime, who knew? So, the old interwebs, all it says we need to do, four liters of vinegar, US one gallon, a tablespoon or so of salt, and then about a cup of dish soap. We got ourselves a sprayer, we're gonna mix it all together. While we let it sit for a minute, we brought the slash, we'll go for a rip around here on the grass, and then we'll start spraying. Kill all the grass. So we figure for a quick minute here, I'm sure you can see about the millions of bugs flying around in front of that camera, that's what I'm dealing with. Before we start killing the grass, maybe we'll we'll take the old uh, slash for a little rip here. Oh, right off the course. We're definitely gonna have to make her a lot longer, that's for sure, we got, we got way too much speed for this thing. But she, uh, she goes good, that's for sure. I really love this RC. Oh, we got a little piece of a stump right there. It keeps catching on. Oh. Whoa, right off the corner. Oh, right off into the bushes. Oh, I think we might be... Oh, roll over. All right, well, I guess that's enough playing around for now. We'll uh, get this mixture uh, shaken up. Start killing this grass so we can actually have ourselves a real track to play in. Just give us a minute. We'll be right back. A few moments later. All right, we got the first bottle down. Sun's going down, so I guess that's it for tonight. We'll come back tomorrow. We'll see if this grass is hopefully dead. We can start digging this thing up. We are gonna have to cut a little bit longer so we can go that way, and we will extend it over a handful more feet that way, but we'll start with this patch. See you tomorrow. So it's the next day and we're back. And I'd have to say that mixture of vinegar, dish soap, and salt really did the job. If you can see, hopefully you can see on camera, this stuff is dead as dead can be. You can see the dirt already coming through nicely, so that's good. Our next step's gonna be a rototiller. We are gonna trim up a little bit more of this and kill it as well. We're gonna try and do a good, I don't know, 
100 foot by 50 foot wide, that kind of thing. Um, so, all right, we have a little bit of rain coming for the next couple of days, unfortunately, so that's going to slow us down. But after that, we're back to digging. We'll see you soon. Well, we finished getting all the grass and junk cut, as you can see behind us. You can see by the black lines and stuff, we got the track kind of laid out. We've already started digging. Give me a minute, I'll turn the camera around. We'll give you a little walk through our plan. Then we'll finish this video off. So this isn't necessarily where we're gonna start, but this is the way we're gonna go. So we're gonna be going in through here. We're gonna have a dip down around this corner and then straight into a nice little jump up. Then come straight over into here. Get this all nice and flat. Gonna have another nice big jump that's gonna come off right here. Land down over right here, straight into this next corner. We'll bank all this out, of course. Back down into here. We'll have another jump because we've got that rock right there to work around. Um, so we'll have another jump right here. We'll just fill this all in with dirt. We got this all dug up already. So we're gonna work our way down through here. We're gonna work our way back around this corner. Back up this way. We're gonna have another jump right in here somewhere. Sorry, get right up here. Have another jump in here somewhere. In this area going up through here. Up into this next corner. Work our way back around. We got some big rocks we had to work around, so that's kind of the way the track is. So back down in through here. We'll do something obviously in along this way. Maybe we'll just leave it as a nice fast back stretch. Got a tree here we gotta get out. And then back around to where we started. So I think that should do pretty good for now. We've still got lots of room over here and here that we can do. We got one big tree right there that we would have to get rid of. Um, but we've got lots more room to go. Still a flat track to build. So lots to do. So thanks so much for watching. We're gonna keep digging. We probably got at least a couple more days to dig. We got a bunch of rain coming in the next few days. So that's gonna probably slow us down, unfortunately. Um, but we're gonna work as hard as we can to get this thing up and going. So if you're not already a subscriber, hit that subscribe button down below so you don't miss the next build video. Um, if you've got any suggestions on what you wanna see us do to this track, since we haven't really done much other than the layout, drop them down in the comments. And if you could give us a big thumbs up, cause that always helps. Thanks so much. And we'll see you again soon.